This is going to be a video tutorial on how you could use VLC Media Player as a uh, screen recorder. VLC Media Player has been around forever. It's uh, great software for uh, watching movies and stuff. It's free. Uh, a lot of people don't realize you could actually use it as a screen recorder, though. The way you use it as a screen recorder is... Uh, I'll put a link down in the description if you don't already have VLC Media Player. But uh, the way you use it as a screen recorder is you have to open it first, of course. Then you will click on Media. Go down to where it says Open Capture Device. Select that. Then from this dialog box, you want to change the uh, capture mode to Desktop. And then from here, you want to change the uh, frames per second. It's uh, default, it's set at one frame per second. That's extremely low. You want to probably make it, uh, you could either use the uh, arrows here, or I'll just double click on the one there and change it to, I'll change mine to 30. 30 is a good frame per, frames per second. Uh, you could also use 60. I'm going to go with 30 though. Then after that, you want to click on the little arrow next to play. You don't want to click on play, you want to click on the little arrow next to play and click on convert. And from here, under settings, you will uh, choose uh, what type of video you want to record. I have mine set to video H.264 plus MP3, MP4. Uh, if you click the little drop down arrow, another decent one would be uh, either 1080p or 720p MPEGs. Uh, I'll leave mine on video H.264 plus MP3, MP4. Then you want to click on Browse. You want to choose your file destination. I will name my file Record2. Now I'll click Save. And then once you click Start, the uh, screen recorder begins. I'll click Start here. And as you can see, the numbers here are starting to move. Uh, four seconds, five seconds, six seconds. Uh, you could have any screen open that you would like on your desktop. I have uh, Adobe Illustrator here opened. I'll move some things around here. I'll go back to my VLC media player. It's at 30 seconds, 32 seconds, 33 seconds. I'll, plus, I'll press stop here. Then I will go to the folder that I saved the video into, Record 2. This is the one that I just recorded. I'll double click on that. And here is the uh, video that I just recorded. Like I said, you could record any screen that you have open. It just records your... Uh, your desktop screen no matter what you have open one drawback to this is it does not record audio to record audio uh, I have Windows 10 here and to uh, record audio I would have to uh, use a uh, voiceover use voice meter or something a voice vo voiceover to record uh, the audio but it will record your screen but that's it thanks for watching